Hello everybody and welcome. I am extremely excited about today's reaction video because this is a movie I have wanted to do for a very long time. Basically since I saw Encino Man and just fell back in love with Brendan Fraser. It's been requested several times. People have really wanted me to see this movie. I've really wanted to see this movie, but it has not been available to stream or rent anywhere that I could find. For the last almost year, it seems like I have I just I randomly check every so often just just to see if it happens to be somewhere. And finally, the other day it came up available to stream and I said, yeah, that's what we're doing this week. And of course, that movie, in case you didn't look at the thumbnail or read the title of the video, is Airheads. We're finally going to watch Airheads. I don't know what you think about Airheads, except that it's from the early 90s and it's got Brendan Fraser. I don't need anything else. So let's check out Airheads. Oh, is this music related? Brendan Fraser, of course. Oh, Shemmy! Adam Sandler's in this? Chris Farley, say less. What do you think you were for? I even know who that is. Oh, you guys, I am, I am hyped. I think that's a uh, Kramer, right? Ah, oh, the glorious locks. Is that his or is that a wig? Judy on the second floor. It's that guy in the delivery uniform again. <laughs> Feel like wetting yourself? Go with it, okay? Anarchy's good. They like anarchy. I don't. Do they like pee? Jeez, do you want to blow this? You know how much these stupid hats send me back? Thirty bucks. Excuse me. Mike, it's him. The wacko's back. The wacko. Yeah, I'm up here in A and R. Right? <laughs> <laughs> Called unsolicited material and the lawyers would have a fit. Hey, but this is the real thing, man. This is rock and roll and none of that young gimmicky stuff. Super duper. Thanks. All right, dude. Thanks. Aww. Take care now. Aww. You had this whole stack of invoices and he made me arrange them by date. What a monster. What the hell happened to my makeup? It's on the toilet. Ugh. Oh, jeez. You ruined my makeup, you butt. I was down at Palatine Records. That's where I was. Really? I mean, I didn't get anywhere or accomplish anything, but I was there. The guy said he'd snap us up in a second if it weren't for the lawyers being such dingleberries. <laughs> Did he like the tape? Just about to give it to him, then a security guard showed up and ruined everything. <laughs> <laughs> I'm doing the bullshit work and you're living the rock and roll life. I'm doing this for us. Maybe you should get a job. <laughs> This, this is my job, okay? He practically broke out in hives. You gotta sit in a nice office all day smoking and drinking coffee. Ah! Oh, this shit! Bullshit. Oh. We're never gonna be anybody. I can't believe this. You treat me like I'm some necklace goober after I wrote this song for you? Oh, you wrote that song before you even met me. So? <laughs> hey, oh, God, keep hey, going! Play the poser! No. Woo! I knew you were a loser! Oh, she big mad. That's a lot of expensive stuff. Right again, huh? Oh, what a bitch. Chevy looks like Dave Grohl. Six months from now, we're on the cover of Rip Magazine, looking all. Look, he works a job. <laughs> hey, My freaking uncle looked exactly like that in the '90s. That's just it. That's the way you guys think. Think everything's gonna happen to you. You gotta make it happen. How many practices have you missed because you're cleaning up some stiff's pool? He looks so, so sad. Yeah, well, we got the look, man. We're gonna be huge. Yeah. That's all you need, right? <laughs> Shooting phlegm all over my ass. Say zoom tight. I say it for you, man. I mean, yeah, you gotta hustle, but you also gotta, you know, live now. The incredible crash dummies. Woo! I mean, most of these guns are discontinued. <laughs> what is he making out with it? Doozy water pistols from a Flash Battalion combat set. They got rid of it because it looked too real. Yeah, that'll get you shot. Pepper sauce. Hey! Oh! 
Not Stretch Armstrong. They play this song on the radio and they got an album and everything. That's what we got to do. Man, this is, it's funny to think about how different it is now. How dependent you were on everybody else, you know, getting you there, you know, record companies and stuff. Anybody gives us any static, I shove this in their face. <laughs> yeah, but remember that fat kid on hard copy with a toy gun? The cop zapped him with a taser until he went bald. He sued him for a million bucks when his pubes didn't grow in. Still got no hair on his balls, man. <laughs> he raises an excellent point. Is it worth it? Oh, is it a Game Gear? Hey, the thing took my car! What did they think was gonna happen? It is too. I always gotta tell you to put pants on when somebody comes over. That he's making this up! <laughs> Come on, man, we ain't locked out yet. Ah, you got a big mouth, man! <laughs> I didn't realize he was Pip of Pip's pool cleaning. Basically owns his own business. <laughs> oh, ah! oh my god! Now he's missing some teeth. Gotta go. <laughs> Bye. Get it a hold the Oh. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> well, this is beautiful. I try to be a team player. Yeah, that's who I thought it was. I need you to come in tomorrow. Cutting loose a lot of dead weight. There's gonna be a lot going on here. I've been having a little bit of um, itching on my. Um, I mean, it could be hemorrhoids. I don't want to hear that. No, joke. I know, I know. It's just that I made an appointment with my proctologist to get some cream or something. Could have just said you gotta go to the doctor, man. I suppose I could come in for most of Saturday and Sunday. Well, yeah, yeah. Bring your itchy butthole right on into work. We're a band. No babies! He's got this place sealed up like a dolphin's butt. Watertight. <laughs> <laughs> what sound are you uh, megastars of the future hip to? It's more like, more like power a power slot. slot. Power slot. We don't like to limit ourselves to labels. Catchy. I screwed up. She's been there for me practically from the beginning. Uh oh, I think we're busted. <laughs> I get six minutes of talk time every hour. What do you care how I spend them? Ian's just having some fun. Put your hands off me. You wanna try getting physical with me? Listen, you shaved ape. It's actually quite hairy. Kind of the opposite of shaved. I will not be pushed around by Hollywood Boulevard trash like you. Uh oh. What are you doing? You better than me? Huh? Oops. Get a gun! Oops. Your stupid face! I know exactly what I'm doing. <laughs> you got your stylish little pony nub. Better than even real. <laughs> I'm out there in the clubs and on the streets, and I'm living it. I am rock and roll. Yeah. Doing that Jimmy Wing down in Palatine that ruined everything for everyone. Jimmy, oh, Jimmy, God. they're talking about young KBPX. I mean, kinda. They don't know a damn thing about rock and roll. I mean, he doesn't look like he does. That's for sure. Play it. What are you waiting for? Sorry about all this. Enjoy. Can't wait. Enjoy. We're only set up for CDs and cassettes. Chaz, I said we should have brought a cassette. A cassette that knocks out the low end and it makes my background vocal sound like someone's stepping on my nuts. You quit necking on me, you femmes, all right? All we got was a quarter inch, okay? There's gotta be a reel to reel around here somewhere. Now all she needs a USB. My brother can't open his mouth without the white man slap him down. Damn. <laughs> He's like, oh. See that there's this idiot just crawling around. You catch that one, Jake? Don't call me G. What do you want me to call you? How about just don't talk? <laughs> How do they not hear him flopping around? Ew. What is that? Don't light it. I mean, that suit's probably covered in a lot of chemicals, too. Give us a real nice intro. And uh, don't say anything about us having a gun to your head. Cover all your bases. The Lone Rangers? How can you pluralize the Lone Ranger? What's wrong with that? Well, there's three of you. You're not exactly lone. Shouldn't you be the three Rangers? There I go, shit. Did not go well. Ah, too late. What? You go. <laughs> of course. When I wake up now, he was a
Yeah, they're hardened criminals, all right. And nobody leaves until we figure this out. What was she on the cards? <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Kramer's still eluding him. I told you. Uh, if she doesn't sit on the floor, I don't know why I have to. Because you're not cute. Sit down on the floor now. Everybody else gets to sit in a chair except for you. <laughs> you made contact? No, sorry. Yeah. One guy came out, but he went right back in. Yeah. I have dispatch, you gotta send numberless. Yeah! Establish contact, make sure it's not a false alarm. I know the procedure. I hope my limiter is on. Well, there's three psychotic musicians in here with guns. How would you feel? <laughs> wants to know what your demands are for releasing the hostages. Oh my god. Did you just figure out that's what you were? I don't want anything. I just don't want to go outside. <laughs> my name's Susie with two Z's. Ah. Oh. Of course it is. So you like answer the phones and all that stuff for like six hours a day. It's called a job. <laughs> <laughs> that guy's just like, kill me now. I came here for a lousy three minutes and 31 seconds of airplay. That's it. No, there's cops outside with guns and you're holding people hostage. It is a mess. And on top of that, your tape is destroyed. There's only one thing that you can do. The other copy of the demo. I was gonna say play live, but... Bastard! <laughs> Groupies already! What the hell is this, man? You invited me to come out! Well, you just caught us a little by surprise. I'm sorry to know You wanna play this tape on the radio, then you'll come out. That's right. My girlfriend's got the only other copy. She's out for the night. You're gonna have to go find her. Or is she? I don't know. I'll try the strip somewhere. She's totally pissed at me. <laughs> I don't black people like me. You know, I listen to uh, a lot of rap music. You try too hard. How about when you go into a store and all the clerks start staring at you like you're gonna rob the place? I'm sorry, that's never happened to me. Does that happen to you? Ah? Huh? No. Ah? Huh? Just saying, now it would be bad if it did. Look at Chaz out there doing his thing. That's why they don't like you, son. You're weird about it. You have your orders, Chief, not get cracked. <laughs> Cops are going to get Kayla, and we gotta send one person out. I'll go. <laughs> why don't we let Yvonne go, man? I don't see why you automatically have to choose a woman. Well, it's kind of sexist, don't you think? Okay. Yvonne, get your shit and go. You'll be home in time for the Simpsons. <laughs> you just shouldn't talk. I think you're exceeding the maximum weight limit for that belt. <laughs> <laughs> hey! Fuck you! Sending out a soup of the Sunset Strip for the girlfriend. <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> <laughs> I want this movie to end with him never getting anywhere, just crawling around in the vents and accomplishing nothing. <laughs> it's like the secret of Nim, but funny. <laughs> oh, they're loving it. Oh man, they're not your buddies, they're your hostages. I was just trying to be nice. Oh, bless your heart. I think it's real, right? Now show me what you got. Get over there, please. Thank you. No. <laughs> Dead bodies flying through the air like freaking rag dolls on fire. <laughs> okay. How did they not hear him? All right, against the wall. Seriously, move it. Not the voice crack. I'm gonna stab your heads off. With what? With what? With my dead head. Throat. <laughs> Shit. Here comes the cavalry. Oh, SWAT's here. Twelve years of marriage down the tooth. I'm in the middle of negotiations until I decide there are no options. You don't use force. It's your show. I wonder why your wife let you. It can't be because you're actually insane looking. Put me through to somebody on the scene. I don't have much time. <laughs> oh, look, the media. You got any kind of training? Well, I was in the Merchant Marines. Marines, yeah, I copy that. Yeah, missed part of that sentence. But I was an accountant. Nah, you won't be held accountable. You're not listening. As long as we're running the joint, we may as well hear some decent jams. <laughs> She's having a great time. <laughs> ah! I'm telling you, 
concert tickets. Get the swag. Shit, man, you guys ought to have fun. Can't cuss on the air. Oh no, what are you gonna do to stop me? What if they call the FCC? Take a few calls. Am I on the air? Come on, buddy, give me the phone. <laughs> <laughs> This freaking guy. Drop my underwear on the floor one time. Eeny weeny weeny little skid mark. It wasn't one time, I promise. I think gets his hands on more bumper than a body shop. <laughs> With that, I seem so stupid, I must be cute routine. You got a ton of hot CDs here and I never hear this stuff. Why don't you ever play these guys? Why don't we play them, Milo? They're so hot, how come they're not tearing up the charts, babe? Because you never play them, babe. You suck. You yeah, he's got a whole stockpile of easy listening shit shingles in his office. You don't even listen to music, Milo. What are you doing with a whole crate of CDs? I hear some new shit right now. Oh, they're fucked! Yeah, dude. I mean, Kenny G is another level, though, I'm just saying. He's different. Blonde wearing something tight and black. Oh, good luck, buddy. Put a sock in it, okay? <laughs> Why did they send the rookie again? What the hell are these? And this? Come here. That's what the downsizing is about. Sunday midnight, the station goes soft rock, and we're being forced to restaff. She put. All those blowjobs were nothing. You're firing me? Woohoo! This was handed down from above, Ian. I bought this thing kicking and screaming. Oh, I bet. You've just begun to kick and scream, you sniveling putts. I'll kill you. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh my spot. Best day of work ever for these guys. Oh, no. <laughs> now, what are you going to do about that? <laughs> <laughs> Improvise. Tit for tat! He was only cleaning the pool filter, Sniggles. And I'm thinking to myself, it's 7 p.m., he's in dungarees, and his equipment is bone dry. Pool filter my ass! Did Pip get his wife? I really need that demo tape, and you gotta get it down to the station. We'll, just, we'll talk about it. Oh, that tape is hosed. Shoot, dog! Oh, shit! <laughs> Ew, no. Does he have a Snapple? Tell me it's a Snapple! 67 copies of Moby Dick. The movie or the book? They made a book out of that? Yeah, I think so. We're gonna take the cops up on those demands they wanted. We got a killer list. It is a Snapple! We ask for airplay and whatever else we want. Then we demand a whole bunch of weird stuff. This way we can plead insanity later. Y'all are all woohoo and shit. <laughs> this guy got, got weed and not sharing. Football helmet filled with cottage cheese. I want me a PRS guitar, the dragon inlay. <laughs> like making a Christmas list here. For Santa. Number 13, naked pictures of B. Arthur. How am I supposed to find all this stuff? She might she might give them to you if you ask. What are you asking for a record contract for? That's what we want. Don't just demand one from the cops, okay? It's got to come unsolicited. What's unsolicited? Forget it. Does he know? Do you have a girlfriend? Mm -hmm. No. I'm weird at screaming like this. Huh? I don't know. The weird part is I can see why this works. This is Primo Advertising. Are you selling ads on our airtime? He's networking. You just hung up on a very important man. Yeah. Ah! <laughs> By the rat tail. <laughs> Get it, Pip! Find anything in that van? To pool cleaning gear. Pool cleaning gear. Uh-oh! A gun! That's affirmative. These cowboys are much more dangerous than I thought. It's gonna get Kramer to try to take him out? You know, I'm screwed up in average enough that I could write a song that'll live on forever. And then after that, it don't matter. Effective Monday, this station goes easy listening. We have a special segment called Getting to Know Your Armed Assailant. <laughs> All we had to say is that we want to be heard. Well, we've kind of established that. What else? <laughs> now we want to hear what you got to say. Standing in front of 20,000 screaming fans. What are you gonna say to him? Rock and roll. I'm gonna say. Rock and roll! <laughs> ah! There's a saying, Milo. If it's too loud, you're too old. Key. <laughs> ah, look at him. Suffer. I don't want this guy to have a gun. What are you doing, you little butt nut? <laughs> They're not 
not happy with you. You're firing them. If there is one stain on that couch. You what? Fire me? Green festive. Oh, Pip. <laughs> That's a disappointment. Oh, Pip. I'm a hostage and Pip is my, Pip is my man with a gun. I mean, I've heard of Stockholm Syndrome, but this is something else. Pip, put the monster away. All right, everybody back to the booth. Chris Moore, Capitol Records, A&R, come on, let me in. I told you, man, things are going our way. It's Harold Ramis, let him in no matter what. I don't care who he is. This is the hottest thing since Marky Mark and the Funky Bunch. Marky Mark, man, that guy sucks. He found another line of work, it's fine. What side did you take, Halen or Roth? Van Halen. He's a cop. Oh, oh taken. Oink, oink. Who would win in a wrestling match, Lemmy or God? Lemmy. Ah. God. Wrong, dickhead, trick question, Lemmy is God. Yeah. Oh, come on. This old valley, huh? Now you're bringing the cops and you're trying to kill me? I, I've been done. I'd have let him in. It's Egon. Of course I'm going to let him in. We got the numbers! Rodney King! Rodney King! Rodney King! Rodney King? What's that supposed to mean? He's that guy. He's that guy? <laughs> Damn it! Turn the goddamn power back on! No! I... Oh, oh my god. I can't believe you're... Oh my god. There's a lot Chester didn't tell you about, right, Chester? What's he talking about, Chester? Kayla, there's something I gotta tell you. I was a geek in high school. <gasps> I played Dungeons and Dragons. What? My name's not Chaz. It's Chester. Oh my god, he uses a fake name. And I understand if you don't love me anymore. Your Gene Simmons, his name is not Gene Simmons. I play D&D too. Yeah, man! All the editors of the school magazine! <laughs> I used to wear corduroy pants! I used to masturbate constantly! Woo! Who is it, Jazz? I want your body! You get famous in 20 years, your real name's gonna be all over Wikipedia anyway. Nice try, loser who lost his wife to a pool cleaner. This is my girlfriend Kayla. She brought the tape. It's not good though. What did you do to my tape? Took real good care of it, didn't you, Yoko? Yoko? About time they treated me with a little respect. I don't have time for this noise. Now, did you come down here to bitch at Rex or to help us out? Because right now, you're being a complete. <laughs> okay, that is unnecessary because we're just discussing. Not okay. I'm a part of this. You wrote that song for me. That's my song. Oh, is that right? I wrote that song before I even met you. That's right, we don't need you. I don't like that look. What do you look at me? <laughs> Someone's got some serious issues. Christ, what are you doing? You don't even care. No. You don't even care what happens to me. No. Come on, here I am. I'm holding a gun to a guy's head just so the whole world can hear your song. Is that love or what? Tell me. What do you want from me? She wants you to say I love you, but you can't, because you don't. I love you. Oh my god. <laughs> what else can I say? Crazy in the head equals crazy in the bed. We all know this, but uh, I don't think this is a good match. <laughs> yeah, see? Psycho bitch ruined it. Thanks for getting the stuff. Flap away, friend. You're not gonna get it. Oh no! No, <laughs> gross! <gasps> well, it looks like uh, Susie isn't the only one climbing the corporate ladder. <laughs> of course, he takes the helmet full of cottage cheese. I don't know, man. Maybe we didn't make the demands weird enough, huh? <laughs> Shit. And now he's letting loose. I mean, it's not all bullshit. Of course. Of course. Come against the wall and put your hands above your head. But Kramer has a real gun. <laughs> yeah, Ian! <laughs> and now they're gonna back off again because there's gunshots! <laughs> I love Ian! He 
Ryan's the best. <laughs> hello. Yes, hello. Put the pig on. <laughs> Everybody okay in there? You shit witch! What the hell was that? Shit witch! Guys coming in through the ceiling at me. I swear to you, we don't have anybody trying to break in. You don't. Okay, now how about sending out a, another hostage just as a sign? You already got two. Right there. That that was huge. Thanks. Rock and roll. Yeah. Hi, Chess. Jimmy Wing. Remember me? Oh, we know at least this one is a record exec. Hi, how are you? B. Arthur. Outstanding. <laughs> I told you she'd be cool. Okay, I know you guys think I'm a real dick cheese. You are. I need someone to negotiate for you. Now, I will offer my services for 10% of the pre-tax gross. That's standard. He's right, but make that 5% mile oh. you scum-sucking weasel. Yeah. Let me back in, man. I'm not going to try anything. Come we on. shouldn't have escaped then. <laughs> the hostages want to come back. Remember when Ozzy got busted for pissing on the Alamo and he got banned from San Antonio for a decade at his time, went back, rocked the place. True story. Bro, where's the tape deck? Why, we need that too? Let me see your arm. Oh, what? Whoa! The sauce from the gun on the burrito. Perfect. <laughs> Got a contract! <laughs> Probably could have had him courting you, I'm just saying. What are you doing with that? Didn't you play a song for him? No, no, we didn't hook this thing up yet. Oh, he doesn't feel like he earned it. It's not just the music. Whoa, what am I hearing? What's wrong, man? What if they're terrible? You want to know what I think of your contract? Allow me to demonstrate. Wipes his ass with his record contract. I love this guy. It's rock and roll. You already are a star. You can't buy this kind of media exposure. Just wait 10 seconds, listen to the tape, and then sign him. Rock stars don't go to jail. Vince Neil only did 30 days and he killed somebody. <laughs> swear you can get us off? I swear. If you guys play ball. Now that's that's a, that's driving a bargain. Well, what about the song, though? How are we going to play the... Uh, they have some more demands. <laughs> Whoa! This movie is not discouraging me from using uh, ransom and hostage situations to get what I want. This only works if you still have the hostages, okay, Kayla? Gun cut! Uh, it's all an act. This is a soggy dream come true! <laughs> right! Woo! It's good to Did they mean a wet dream? What? It ain't giving us no juice. The amps are props. They're just background for the video. We're gonna play your tape through the PA system and you guys just pantomime. No, that won't work. So that's all we are to you, huh? Some freak show? For all you care, our album could be pit farting on a snare drum. I ain't farting on no snare drum. <laughs> Guys, don't do it. We don't have a deal. We walk. They'll get people all over them. They don't need you. Listen, dirthead. Shut your mouth and do what you're told. Oh, this is, see, this, this is how they mean to go on. What are you doing? We're filming! Oh! <laughs> Done. Manager now or something. Oh man. Did you did you <laughs> what are you doing, man? Humping his guitar. What's it look like? Six months. Well, three months to think ahead of stuff. <laughs> album live in prison with triple platinum. I'd buy that album. Okay, so that was Airheads, and god damn did I have a good time watching that movie. I'm sure I'm a little bit biased because, you know, that that was my childhood, that whole that whole time period. So, you know, the clothes and the music and the styles and you just 
the, the pop culture references, they, they were all just right up my alley. It just hit me in all the nostalgia places. It was amazing. I loved the the cast, the whole cast, the main actors, the secondary ones. I recognized so many people. It was so much fun. They did a great job. Kind of a semi-serious reflection of the music industry and the hurdles people had to go through and how unfair and arbitrary some of it was. But they did it in such a funny way. That was pretty clever. And I I loved the characters, like, like I said, and I, I liked just how the story went. I loved the ending, how they, you know, they got their record deal in the end, but they did have to serve their time. I'm not so sure I'm sold on the uh, hyper-violent girlfriend. I don't know if that's such a good idea, but hey, what is a rock star without an extremely turbulent personal relationship? This was just an amazingly fun, hilarious movie. I had such a great time watching it. I, I hope you enjoyed watching me react to it. It's just thanks to everybody who kept requesting it, it kept it in my mind so that I would keep looking for it and just, just holding on to that faith that someday we'd get it and we finally have and it was so worth the wait. Thank you all for being here. Don't forget to like and subscribe. You can find the full commentary to this movie in my Patreon. The link is in the description below. Have a great rest of your day. Take care of yourselves because I love you. That was a bad heart, but I love you. And I will see you next time.